Ave Maria, welcome again to Cato Pinoy Franciscan Vesper or Evening Prayer. We are now in Evening Prayer 1 of the Solemnity of the Sacred Heart of Jesus. So if you have your bravery like this or digital, let us start by praying the invocation of Saint Bonaventure. Lord, open my lips to praise your holy name. Cleanse my heart from any wordless, evil, distracting thoughts. Give me the wisdom and love necessary to pray this office with attention, reverence, and devotion. Father, let my prayer be heard in your presence, for it is offered through Christ our Lord. Amen. O God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. O Christ, Redeemer of mankind, Creator of our earth, Light of light and God of God, Son of eternal birth, Love forced you to become a man, that pardon you could win, a second Adam could restore, what Adam lost by sin, that love which of your bounty made, the earth and sky and sea, had mercy on our parents' fall, broke bonds and set us free. May wondrous love in endless flood flow from your wounded side, May nations win your saving grace, and Lord with you abide. For this you bore the land's trust, and scourge and thorns and pains, that blood and water from your heart might wash away our stains. Glory be to Jesus Christ, whose heart does grace ascend, to Father and the Spirit too for ages without end. For Santiphone, God has loved us with an everlasting love. Therefore, when He was lifted up from the earth, in His mercy He drew us to His heart. Psalm 113 Praise O servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. May the name of the Lord be blessed both now and forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its setting, praise be the name of the Lord. High above all nations is the Lord, above the heavens His glory, who is like the Lord our God, who has risen on high to His throne, yet stoops from the heights to look down, to look down upon heaven and earth. From the dust He lifts up the lowly, from his misery he raises the poor, to set him in the company of princes, yes, with the princes of his people. To the childless wife he gives a home, and gladdens her heart with children. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. First Antiphon. God has loved us with an everlasting love. Therefore, when He was lifted up from the earth, in His mercy He drew us to His heart. Second Antiphon Learn from me, for I am gentle and humble of heart. From Psalm 146 My soul give praise to the Lord. I will praise the Lord all my days. Make music to my God while I live. Put no trust in princes, in mortal men in whom there is no help. Take their breath, they return to clay, and their plans that they come to nothing. He is happy who is helped by Jacob's God, whose hope is in the Lord his God, who alone made heaven and earth, the seas and all they contain. It is he who keeps faith forever, who is just to those who are oppressed. It is he who gives bread to the hungry the Lord who sets prisoners free, the Lord who gives sight to the blind, who raises up those who are bowed down, the Lord who protects the stranger and upholds the widow and orphan. It is the Lord who loves the just, 
but towards the path of the wicked. The Lord will reign forever. Zion's God from age to age. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Second Antiphon, Learn from me, for I am gentle and humble of heart. Third Antiphon, I am the Good Shepherd, I pasture my sheep, and I lay down my life for them. Canticles taken from the book of Revelation, chapter 4, verse 11, chapter 5, verse 9, 10, and 12. O Lord our God, you are worthy to receive glory and honor and power. For you have created all things. By your will they came to be and were made. Worthy are you, O Lord, to receive the scroll and break open its seals. For you were slain, with your blood you purchased for God men of every race and tongue, of every people and nation. You made of them a kingdom and priests to serve our God, and they shall reign on the earth. Worthy is the Lamb that was slain, to receive power and riches, wisdom and strength, honor and glory and praise. Glory be to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Third Antiphon, I am the Good Shepherd. I pasture my sheep, and I lay down my life for them. Reading is taken from the letter of St. Paul to the Ephesians, chapter 5, verse 25b to 27. Christ loved the church. He gave himself up for her to make her holy, purifying her in the bath of water by the power of the word, to present to himself a glorious church, holy and immaculate, without stain or wrinkle or anything of that sort. Let us pause a moment of silence for reflection of this reading. Responsory, Christ loved us, and in his blood he has washed away our sins. Response, Christ has loved us, and in his blood he has washed away our sins. He has made us a kingdom and priest to serve God our Father. Response, and in his blood he, was, he has washed away our sins. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Response Christ has loved us, and in his blood he has washed away our sins. Canticle of Mary I have come to cast fire upon the earth. How I long to see the flame leap up. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me and holy is his name he has mercy on those who fear him in every generation he has shown the strength of his arm he has scattered the proud in the conceit he has cast down the mighty from the thrones and has lifted up the lowly 
He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich He has sent away empty. He has come to the help of His servant Israel, for He has remembered His promise of mercy. The promise He made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Canticle of Mary I have come to cast far upon the earth, how I long to see the flame leap up. Intercessions Brethren, let us pray to the Lord Jesus the refuge of our souls let us ask him response most loving lord have mercy on us jesus whose heart when pierced by a lance poured forth blood and water and gave birth to your spouse the church response cleanse and sanctify us jesus holy temple of god slain by men and raised up again by the father Response, make your church the dwelling place of the Most High. Jesus, King and center of all hearts, you love us and lead us to yourself with an ending love and mercy. Response, renew your covenant with all men. Jesus, our peace and reconciliation, you unite all in the peace of the new creation and put enmity to death through the cross. Response, Show us the path to the Father. Jesus, our life and resurrection, you refresh the burden and give rest to the weary. Response, draw all sinners to yourself. Jesus, because you loved us with so great a love, you were obedient even to death on the cross. Response, raise up again all who sleep in your peace. So, brothers and sisters, let us include in this Franciscan Vesper or evening prayer in, uh, in the solemnity of the Sacred Heart, our family, relatives, friends, and loved ones. Our, let us not forget our frontliners, our brothers and sisters affected by this pandemic, our faithful departed, and let us pose a moment of silence for our personal intention. Now let us pray together the prayer our Lord Jesus Christ taught us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil father we rejoice in the gifts of love we have received from the heart of jesus your son open our hearts to share his life and continue to bless us with his love we ask this to our lord jesus christ your son who lives and reigns with you in the holy spirit one god forever and ever amen the Lord be with you and with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, your family, friends, and loved ones, your health, your work, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. So thank you very much for 
praying with me. Once again, I'm Father Johannes Jeremy Maria Salise of the Franciscan Friars of the Immaculate Beacon Mission. Telling you all, smile, be happy. Mama Mary loves you. Ave Maria.